Tonight, new developments involving the boyfriend of a missing La Jolla woman. Dia Abrams disappeared in 2020. As CBS 8's David Gofferton reports, a judge ordered Keith Harper removed as co-trustee after hearing evidence he was trying to sell Abrams Ranch near Idlewild. My concerns are as to Mr. Harper's alleged efforts to hypothecate property that he has no authority to hypothecate or sell. It was the straw that broke the camel's back when Keith Harper, the boyfriend of missing woman Dia Abrams, tried to list her 117-acre Bonita Vista ranch near Idlewild for sale. Six days ago, Harper allegedly contacted Orange County real estate agent Janine Daniels, telling her, quote, he had owned the Bonita Vista property for 16 years. He believed the property was worth $5.2 million, and he would like it to be listed on the market starting in February 2024, according to the agent's sworn declaration in court. Harper has been living on the ranch ever since Abrams mysteriously went missing in June of 2020, two weeks after she amended her trust, naming Harper as co-trustee. Court filings allege Harper has failed to file tax returns, missed mortgage payments, and missed payments on the ranch's fire insurance policy since he has taken over as co-trustee. Back on the record on the Abrams matter. During a hearing Wednesday in Palm Springs probate court, Harper's attorney initially denied that his client tried to list the ranch for sale. We've got unsubstantiated allegations other than this woman saying he wanted to list the property. He, Mr. Harper denies it, that that ever occurred. But over the lunch break, Harper's attorney was shown screenshots of text messages Harper had sent to the real estate agent. And suddenly his attorney was singing a different tune. During the uh, break, Mr. Monroe sent me over a screenshot that uh, Ms. Daniels had received, uh, and I informed counsel and Mr. Monroe that we were withdrawing our objections. And you are withdrawing your objection to what exactly, sir? To the uh, suspension and removal of Mr. Harper. The judge ordered Harper removed as co-trustee immediately. That petition will be granted. Earlier this year, a different court-appointed trustee posted a $300,000 reward for information leading to Dia Abrams' remains and an arrest in the case. That same trustee is now under court order to liquidate her estate, including all three properties near Idlewild. David Goffertson, CBS 8.